Okay, so in here, what I've decided to do is move all of my long sleeve over there, all of this, and then bring my t-shirts from the hall closet in here to wear like for casual stuff. So I think that's what I'm gonna go ahead and do today. And these are the ones that I decided to leave here because it just felt like they didn't fit the sweater reason why I folded those others. Now I'm only going to put the t-shirts that I feel like I'll wear under a blazer or just a basic shirt that like this one I'm going to put back because that's not something that I would probably wear to work. That's something I would probably wear casual. And then I think one thing with me is that I also have a lot of t-shirts that I forget are in here that I don't wear. See, like there's that other tiger one. I think I might fold that white one and put it in here. But yeah, I just have lots of t-shirts that I don't wear for whatever reason. I think I just don't remember that I have them in here. I definitely want to keep them. I just need to remember that they're in this drawer in my master closet. Okay. So basically, I have this space here <laughs> where I took the items that I had there and put them back there. So now I'm wondering what I should put in that space because there is a gap there. Ideally, what I'd like to do is get these little trays out of here. But I don't think that I want to hang any of these. I heard that the graphic tee under the jacket was an outgoing trend. But I don't see myself giving up on my t-shirts. <laughs> so what I could do is I could hang all of these and just have them here to wear also. Because I don't see myself not wearing them. And I would have more access to them if they were hung up. That then would leave this drawer empty. Maybe for me to put my socks in. Because basically that's what this is. It's just full of socks. And it would help me put shoes here. So I have a lot of shirts in here. Some that I don't know that I would even wear anymore. So I'm going to go through these really quick. I get tired of this folding and hanging, folding and hanging, but I just want to utilize the drawer space and the hanging space the best way I can. I should have plenty of hangers to do that and maybe do a final go through to, to see if I actually want everything in this drawer. So, so in this top drawer, I have all of my socks that I wear underneath my boots and stuff like that. So what I might do is I might take this out and just put these two baskets in here instead. I just think about hanging all those shirts and it's not really something that I want to do mainly because although I probably would wear them under a jacket or something but I don't think I would do that to work. So I'm going to take this out. All this is, is my sports bras and top and bottoms that I've had in here that honestly, some of them don't fit me anymore. And some of them I realized were hurting my back because they don't provide the support that I need. So I might just be getting rid of some of these and I don't see the need of having them in this drawer. Now I gotta see if those baskets will fit in here. So I think that'll be the easier fix. Okay, so these baskets will fit in here. If I push it down like that, they kind of get a little wonky right there. But all of these have my dress socks and my tights. So I think that for now, I'll leave them in the baskets. Now, as far as this stuff, I think I might go ahead and move some of this stuff over here. Now, in here, I have all of my 
undergarments and then in this one i have all of my little undershirts and then in here i use those ikea modular containers to organize this drawer so i think what i'll do is somehow get all of this stuff on this side and put over here because it should be together and i think a lot of times i don't wear certain things because i can't find them or i don't know that they're in the wrong place and most of this here is just little undershirts like i have in that drawer over there yeah i think what that's the majority of what all of this is so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna move all of that over here and then i'm gonna move some of my stuff there that's really should go in here so get that organized okay so i've separated these out and i can definitely tell that some of these are way small like this calvin klein sports bra i think i've had forever and i'm pretty sure i bought these when i was 20 pounds lighter and I don't know that they would fit me now, but I did get my use out of them. I mean, a lot of this stuff, I feel like I got my use out of, but I just have a lot of these. Oh, all these belong together. So I think I bought a lot of these when they were selling them as a packet. So I think I can use these like for bedtime. These Calvin Klein, I don't know if they're going to fit me but I definitely can use them for bedtime I think so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put them in my armoire where I have a lot of my night clothes and just maybe put them in one of these baskets maybe this one where I have other little sports bra type of attire so I think that's what I probably will do with this boy just trying to feel that little gap started a whole cleaning isn't that what happens you try to clean one thing in a and then find that you have to clean 10 things before you clean that one thing <laughs> okay so i fit them all in here and then i have this free and some of the other ones i did go ahead and put in my bottom drawer which is here that I go to for night under a tire. So yeah, all of that worked out for now. I will have to do a clean through of all of that as well. I haven't been to Pink or Victoria's Secret in so long, but I really need to get some more and just upgrade what I have. Okay, and then in this drawer, as you can see, I went ahead and just added the shirts that were in also in this tray here and put some of the other non-supporting but that i can wear under a shirt there and then put the rest here so that cleared that out and now back to over here i have this one left that i need to try to organize so it would be ideal probably if I used both of these or just both of these. So let me see what I work out. I might have to use both, but I don't like that these are so tight in here. I'd rather have them kind of free. So let me work on this and see how I can get this better organized. Okay. So this is how this drawer turned out. What I ended up doing was putting all of my tights here, some of my socks here for my slacks, and then my boot socks here. Now when I say boot socks, I mean like my, these are thicker socks that I would probably wear with my, these type of boots. So that's what I mean by the shorter boot sock. And then, I think what I'm going to try to work out here is just get heels that will fit in here. Now, I don't know why I bought so many tall shoes, but 
I did and I was going to put these in here but as you can see they don't fit because they're too high here on the back so I want to get shoes that I can put here that are gonna fit like these do okay so for now what I decided to do was to put like my more spring type blouses here that I may wear during the spring I've had these for a while and I think I need to decide that if I don't wear them this spring that I need to just let them go I did also put these little off the shoulder blouses there which kind of helped free up some space over here I did leave these sweaters here only because I don't see myself wearing those during springtime and so the rest of this is just work wear and so I went ahead and moved some shoes over here so I added these shoes so now all of this is just shoes which is great and got rid of some of the socks that were a little bit older. I think for now, this is how this is looking. I did go ahead and put my taller cage sandals up there. I had them behind this mirror for some reason. I don't know why I had them behind here, but I went ahead and moved them back up there. And I have one little free space right there, right there where I can put shoes Right now, I have put myself on hold for purchasing anything else for the next three months. We'll see how that works out because we have a pretty big debt that needs to be paid and I need to save for that. So I can't believe the little gap there caused all of, the, all of these changes. I am glad that I went ahead and situated this closet and for now... For a while, I hope that it's going to stay like this. So thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.